The Bidwin State House of Assembly has okayed the setting up of an ad hoc committee to look into the communal crisis between the Manzombo and Bevo communities of Igbayongo and Ibila in Gwe East and Uju local government area of the state. This followed a separate motion of public importance moved by Gwe East House of Assembly member Honorable Elias Audu and Blessed Honor of Uju One constituency. Both members lamented the renewed crisis which has brought untold hardship to the community. That on the 11th of June 2023, the two clans of Oju and Ibila were engaged in a communal crisis which claimed many lives and properties worth billion of Naira were destroyed. As I speak with you, Mr. Speaker, distinguished colleague, my people are sleeping under the rain in police stations, in primary schools, and other places where they can put their pregnant women, nursing mothers. There have been perennial crises between the people of Mako, that is Masongo, that live in Tango, and the people of Makume in Bavio. Similarly, there are crises between the people of Makara in Shaw and Ovi in Kumaluka government. And this issue keep occurring in your place day after day. This is not the first time, this is not the second time. It's not good for us. We are praying that operations should come in between them. As the state uh, emergency management board, and the state government in general, with all the relevant agencies, to quickly, as a matter of urgency, intervene in providing the necessary assistance to these people. Thank you, Mr. After deliberations, the House adopted the motions brought by the members and called for deployment of security agencies and the mobilization of humanitarian services to the areas. That the committee is set up to know the root cause of the problem and that the Federal State Emergency Management Agency should, as a matter of, provide relief materials to the people. It's taken. And a team of Army, DSS, Police and Navy, Air Force and Civil Defense be mounted in Kayamu. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.